uh, started by the uh, Swedish and also the Germans, and uh, definitely competed in the former Soviet Union quite a lot. And there's the smile, the trademark smile for Kabayeva. Born in Uzbekistan, now residing in Moscow. <laughs> and look at that beginning. And a lively beat to engage the crowd. She loves to perform for the audience, there's no doubt. And she kicks it with her hoop, <laughs> the hoop with her foot there. Quickly, Diane Simpson, what are some of the required moves in the hoop? Well, you must go in and outside the hoop. You must do some leaps and some jumps and some pivots and some balances. Here she's doing a leap with a toss, and she did it in combination because she performed two leaps. And how high might the hoop be tossed? I think it's going pretty high, perhaps 40 or 50 feet here. And some of the competitors were concerned when they first arrived here because of the scoreboard that is suspended from the ceiling here of Nassau Veterans Memorial Coliseum. In fact, a couple have changed the choreography of their routines. Definitely they were. Kabayeva actually re-choreographed her routines in some places in order to toss next to the scoreboard that's up above. So Alina Kabayeva, the leader after one rotation, will be back with her score in the second rotation. And now, let's return to Jim Lampley.